Welcome to Hartley Voices. Uh, this is our new weekly talk show. We're going to interview someone from the Hartley community. I'm Andrew Jahan. I'm our Vice Principal of Operations. I thought no better way to kick it off than the man himself, Mr. Dick Geyer. Welcome, Mr. Geyer. How are Thank you? Thank you very much. Glad to be here. So I got four questions for Mr. Geyer. We're going to walk and talk as we do this, too. Um, Mr. Geyer, first thing, favorite Hartley experience you ever had? I'd have to say the favorite was winning the state championship and uh, it was just such a sense of accomplishment that uh, I don't think it was ever duplicated in, in uh, my time here. Now tell me, you're a longtime history teacher, knowledge for the sake of knowledge. I had you in my freshman year in class. Right. I'll never forget it. What is your favorite history lesson, era, experience to teach? Well, I think in uh, world history, I like the Napoleonic era. In uh, American history, I like the uh, revolutionary era and the development of the Constitution and government and all of that. I thought those were really interesting things, and I thought kids had to really know about those. Um, favorite colleague you worked with or recalled from back Well, I, there's right? a lot of them, but the one that I'd probably pick would be Jim Palmer, known as SARS. He was uh, one of my best friends. He and I taught history for a long time together, and uh, it was a real great experience. Mr. Geyer told me some great stories about the teacher's lounge back in the day with, with Sarge Palmer. All right, Mr. Geyer is an avid reader. We have a book award named after him. So tell me tell me your favorite book you've read recently. Uh, the book I'm reading right now is pretty good. It's uh, John Grisham's Boys from Biloxi. I'm reading right now. I haven't read any nonfiction for a while, but uh, that's the one I'm on right now. All right. It was great to have you back, Mr. Geyer. Thanks for joining us for Mass today and being with us. My pleasure. Thank you. Yeah.